project is a lot bigger than the other ones, so it will cost you a little bit more, but it's the most important one because this is where the screen will go. Now, this screen is kind of expensive, it's like $20. I mean, it's expensive if you buy it multiple times as I did because I've already broken like three or four of them. But anyway, if you take a look at the first version and the second version, they are kind of the same. The only difference is that now this PCB has a different connector. It still has the old connector, but you see this connector was very fragile. So I had to remove it. I had to use a different one and also the resistance of the wires that I was using, which are called flat wires, I think, or band wires. And I'll try to place some on the screen. The resistance of those wires is very high. So I had to use a different connector, which is not optimal neither because this one is too stiff. So I am deciding on what type of connector to use because as you can see, we are using like eight or nine cables, uh, wires, and we still have to connect two pins for the fan if you want to uh, add an external fan as well to remove the, the smoke, to remove the, the odor from the print and the bad fumes. And yes, we will need like 11 wires, so I still have to decide what type of connector because for now I'm using this one. Works great, but since it's that stiff, it already desoldered or broke for a lot of time. As you can see, just by now, one wire already got disconnected. So yeah, this is not the best option for the wires, so I'll have to think for a different one. Then another change is that now I'm using a 4-inch display, not the 3.2 one. So this is a bit bigger, and I'm still printing only JPEGs. I'm not able to print uh, PNGs because the software that I'm using to pass from an SD, STL file to pictures is only generating PNGs. But for now, with the libraries that I have for the ESP32, I can only print PNG files from the flash memory and not from an SD card. So that means that you have to load the picture to the flash memory in a byte format, 